What we plan to cover here in the Elevate program is a lot about nutrition and fitness, supporting people with um, their pelvic floor health, gut health, so digestive health, therapy and how we move through personal change and transformation, and then finding that balance in, in our daily rituals and practices that we have at home. No matter who I'm talking to or what I'm doing, I'm always wishing that people feel their best. So I think really listening to patients' stories and helping them to understand their journey plays that really important role in making sure that they really get where they want to go. Once you start feeling well and making choices for yourself, I think it's easier to set those goals and follow through with whatever they are, even if it's like something simple, like five minutes of mindfulness. And for me, the, you know, the reminder is when you actually fall out of that balance. And my tolerance for not feeling well <laughs> gets lower and lower, the better and better I feel. We carry a lot as women. We juggle a lot in, in, in our daily lives. And so for us to be as healthy as we can be so that we can show up and um, do all of those roles as well as we need them to be, we also really need to work on our own health and wellness. One thing that I've always made sure of is to surround myself with wonderful women who are supportive and who inspire me and motivate me and inspire me to get to my my best potential or elevate my life. I think it's incredible when we can come together to support each other as a community, learn, grow, appreciate, connect, and elevate.